Hey friends, it's April Holly Smith and I'm back with my week four of no spend September or no spend timber with my grocery haul. You can hear my voice is a little crazy. I was at the Akron Marathon this weekend and I cheered everybody loudly for a couple of hours as they went by. Um, so I'm a little hoarse, but I just wanted to make sure that I was able to share with you what I got with for my groceries this week. So what I have here is kind of a cute little arrangement. I got five cans of tuna for my evening salads. Got a bottle of ranch dressing for Chris so that he could enjoy his salads. I got five heads of lettuce. They were 89 cents each. These tunas were a dollar or were just 65 cents a piece. The ranch was on special for 99 cents. I got two bags of grapes. These are two pounds. They were $1.98 um, for the bag, so I spent $4 on that. Then I got three dozen eggs, and they were back to what I would consider more of a regular price at 89 cents a piece. So then I did shoot over to Duma's and get some chip chop for Chris's lunch. You can see that's two dollars and seven cents worth of lunch meat for him i got both of my receipts here we can go ahead and have a look at these dumas two dollars and seven cents um aldi's the only thing i think that i did not show you was three white breads which were 85 cents a piece and some duplex creams which are cookies for my kids, and I spent $19.36, $2.07. So you can see that I was over budget for my week, which is kind of a bummer. But um, $21 and like 40 cents, like 43 cents, really isn't too bad for my groceries for the week. I do believe that I'm still under for the month. I have not spent my whole $100. And I believe that I have 20-ish dollars left for next Friday when I go shopping. So we'll see how this all works out. I'm going to hold up my receipts in case they weren't that great so that you can see them. This is just kind of a, a quick and dirty get you up to date um, because my kids are ready to get up from their nap. So... You can see I didn't get hardly anything that was frivolous except possibly the cookies. And my, I can tell you my daughters don't think they're frivolous. <laughs> but we do keep them down to just that one package each week because they have to share with their dad. And their dad is not a good sharer. He really enjoys those cookies with his morning coffee. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Just want to let you know that I am going to do a video with all of my receipts for the entire month. It's also going to show some spending that I would consider not grocery spending. I spent some stuff at the post office and a couple of other places and that's going to be in that. So it's going to have a pretty accurate um, picture of my overall spending for the month. I'm going to highlight what I planned to spend and what I didn't plan to spend. So I hope to see you there at the next video when I get that out. Please don't forget to hit subscribe so that you make sure that you know when that video is live and available. Hit the like button. I would appreciate that. Any comments would be great. Maybe share what your grocery list was like this week and what it's like for next week. You know, I'd also like to hear how your no spend September is going because I'm going to make another video about how this has been, this experience has been like in my head because it, it was different than what I expected it to be. So, well, I appreciate you watching. Happy budgeting. I'll see you next time.